Cheering Cheerios, I'm going to read this. I don't think there can be one nation, only a negligible portion of Israel is willing for an altogether state. The core idea of Judaism is, quote, the chosen people, end quote. Uh, not necessarily, not necessarily listening to Judaism, Judaism fanatics. Their lifestyle is incompatible with disbelievers. But that's not all Jews. That's not all Jews. They've, they've, the Zionists have fooled the world into thinking all Jews are Zionists. All Jews are not Zionists. <laughs> Man, I know Jews that are some of the most anti-Zionist people you ever met in your life. German government just seized, froze the bank account of Jews for a just peace. Right? <laughs> Why? Because those Jews are some of the hardcore, most anti-Zionist people you ever met. Right? Because they know Zionism is fanaticism. They know that the Zionists are destroying Israel, right? They're bad for Jews. So I think Jews, Christians, Muslims, Buddhists, I think everyone can live together in peace. We just have to deal with the fanatics, right? Ideally, if you have Zionists that are pretending to be Jews, then the Jewish culture... The Jewish people should deal with them. You have Muslim fanatics, and the Muslims should deal with them. You have Christian fanatics, and the Christians should deal with them, right? That way you deal with your own shit, right? Each family should be responsible for their own fucking family members, right? If, if you have a family, and you have a child or someone in your family that is going around robbing people, hurting people, murdering people, you bring out the fucking sticks and the whip. And you whip them into place. That's what you do. Right? That's what you do. You can sit down and talk to them. But if they continue to do it, you need to deal with them. Otherwise, you're going to have the wrath of the neighborhood coming after you. Or rightfully so. Rightfully so. Right? What do you do with mad dogs? You put them down. Right? 